Okay, Zach, so here's your before and after. So, so that y little yellow dot is the center of your hips. We want to get the center of your hips on the green dot at the top of your swing, which is just fractionally more forward, right? When you get to the top, your hips are swaying the other way, look, right? So that accounts for all this pressure we see building up on your back foot at the top of the swing, right? What you generally start to see is, yes, there's a build-up of pressure under the back foot, but just maybe to P2 or P3, maybe, maybe sometimes just a little bit past P3 there, right? After that, the pressure starts moving forward. Your pressure keeps on going back and keeps on going back, keeps on going back, keeps on going back. But we know your hips are swaying back. So that, that makes a lot of sense, right? What With your hips moving forward now, there you go. You're going to start, to, you know, next time when we get you on the pressure mat, you're going to see a lot more pressure under your left foot. A lot more than, a lot more than 9% under your left foot at the top of your swing, right? A lot more than 9%, right? So the hips moving forward a little bit. Uh, the other thing we talked about was your hands and your grip, right? We want the lot, we want your left thumb just in the lifeline of your of your right hand. That's a pressure point because as you go back, your right hand just comes away from your left thumb there. So you know we worked hard on we worked hard on getting that palm, that you know, lifeline on your left thumb, and then keeping it there for the backswing, and then that just kind of shortens the top of the top of the swing position look so there's more structure more like a 90 degree angle right that's what we're after and then as you start to come down club comes down underneath your shoulder as you move your hips more progressively forward yeah so that's miles better miles better does that make sense mm -hmm. so the the key points once you put your hand on properly is hands in right so hands in first and then we're working on weight forward right so hands in weight forward and that weight forward is just the hips moving forward a little bit as you get up to the top good mate